Hey folks, I'm going to give you a quick intro to the performance library on the Facewear Tech website. So first you want to go to our website and you'll find the training assets page under support here. Just click on training assets and you're going to scroll down past the facial rig library and you'll come up to the video performance library. So what this is, is uh, there's about 12 videos on here that we've put up as examples of uh, completed data for you. So during your evaluation, you know, if you're in your trial or uh, or even if you've purchased licenses, if you ever want to see uh, examples of completed data or um, examples of video quality that's going to work really well with our technology, uh, there's a lot of samples here that you can download. Okay, so there's uh, static cam videos, which are a camera on a tripod. And then there's also, if you scroll down, we have head-mounted camera videos that were filmed using our head-mounted camera systems. So once you choose a video that you want to use, uh, there are three options here for your downloads. You have your tracking files for Analyzer, your animation file for Retargeter, as well as just the raw video in case you want to do it yourself and take it through the whole process. So I have a folder here that, where I've downloaded uh, some samples. So I have a zip, and when I extract the zip file here, uh, it's going to give me my two files I need for Analyzer. So I'll just show you very quickly how to open those up. File open, and you're going to go to your folder and there we go so FWT facewear tracking that's your analyzer file you can open that up and you will see uh, an example of a completed job on this headcam video so you can scrub through uh, you can get an example of where the training frames are represented by these little green tick marks at the bottom on the timeline I'm using control and arrow to toggle through those. So this gives you an example of a completed tracking job that has not just used AutoTrack, but has actually used the pro tracking tools to uh, get 100% of the tracking quality out of this video. Okay, so when you parameterize this video here, uh, there's a new file created, if you had been doing this from scratch, and that would be the FWR file, and that's Facewear Retargeter file. So I'm going to show you an example here in Maya. and uh, I've pulled up a facial rig. Now this rig is actually available as a free download on the website. Uh, I'll show you. I'm using Ilana, which is this one on the right hand side. Okay, so first thing you want to do is pull up your rig. And I'm going to pull up Retargeter. I'm going to go to Performance Open. And I want to select the file that I downloaded. FWR here. And the XML file, the character setup, comes with the rig download. And then I'll do import video and audio. Hit OK. There we are. Now when I start up a new job, I'm going to have my scene all set up for me like this. And now I can get going with some animation. Uh, now because technically an FWR file works with any rig, and it could work in Maya or Max or Motion Builder or Softimage, uh, we don't provide yet uh, completed animation data for you. So this file is simply uh, the file you can use to begin creating animation. Okay. Uh, and then lastly, we have the MOV file that you can kind of use to start a job from scratch. So if I go to File New, or just click the New Job icon here, Input Video File, I can select, again, my MOV that I just downloaded, and hit Create. And depending on how fast your computer is, this should just take a second here. Uh, if it's a very, very long video, you know, it might take you a little extra time, but uh, it's pretty quick. And there you go. You can also click on the example thumbnail image here, and it will bring up a YouTube preview of the actual video, so you can get an idea of what it looks like before you choose to download. One more time, we have tracking files, which is the FWT. We have animation file, which is FWR and then we have the video file which is your MOV. So uh, if you ever have any questions about how to use a performance library or have comments or you know have a suggestion please email us at support at facewartech.com.